The day after a Baltimore police sergeant is shot several times outside his northeast Baltimore home, another large police scene this time out in Baltimore County. It was right over the land in actually over the city line in Lansdowne and police are determining whether or not they have arrested the men responsible for shooting a sergeant, Isaac Carrington. All right. w yeah, WMAR 2 News investigative reporter Brian Kubler went from one scene to the next today and he joins us live right now at shock trauma where the officer continues to recover. Jamie, first things first here, Sergeant Isaac Carrington is still here at Shock Trauma. Police say he is now in critical condition after at least two surgeries so far. This as the officers locate who they think might be responsible for his condition. This was the scene outside Sergeant Isaac Carrington's Northeast Baltimore home Friday morning. Baltimore police stand guard a day after Carrington was shot multiple times in an apparent robbery while he was off duty. But just below the city line in the southern, other officers were in pursuit. Baltimore police say they spotted a car that matched the description from yesterday's shooting, a blue Acura with tinted windows. When they tried to pull it over, the driver sped off into the county, eventually stopping down a dead-end street in Lansdowne. Police arrested one man immediately, but the other ran. After a brief but intense search of a wooded area off Annapolis Road, police say the second man was arrested too. While it is unclear if any weapons were recovered, onlookers got a close-up view of the blue Acura with Virginia plates the men were driving as it was towed away to be processed. They brought out an Acura and I guess sometimes you put two to two together. You hope that this is the people. Because if it is, their victim, a Baltimore police sergeant, is still laying in shock trauma. After at least two surgeries already, Baltimore police tell us Carrington is currently in critical condition, fighting to survive what they will only characterize as several gunshot wounds. So Baltimore police have two men in custody tonight and that car. We have not yet heard any details about their connection to the shooting of Isaac Carrington yesterday. Carrington again remains in critical condition here at Shock Trauma tonight. It is unclear how many more surgeries, if any more surgeries, he is scheduled to have. For now, we are live in downtown Baltimore at Shock Trauma this evening. Brian Kubler, WMAR, 2 News. All right.